Again and again, we would leave some sitting in the hospital waiting room while we went out and borrowed or begged a few dollars here and there until we made up enough to pay the bill. In some cases, I knew people who simply died. I remember burying a 14 years old girl who had died with a ruptured appendix. This is just one of many tragic stories that Tommy Douglas has witnessed firsthand. But out of this horrible experience, a vision was born. Healthcare is a right for everyone. Born in Scotland in 1904, Douglas and his family immigrated to Canada in 1910. They settled in Winnipeg, where he quickly encountered the harsh realities of poverty. As fate would have it, an old leg injury he had received in Scotland began to trouble him again. This time, however, his life was changed by the kindness of a skilled orthopaedic surgeon who treated him free of charge. That moment opened his eyes to a profound truth. Healthcare should be a basic right for everyone, not a privilege reserved for the few. Driven by a deep desire to make a difference, Douglas pursued higher education, graduating from Brandon University in 1924. He became a Baptist minister on the windswept plains of Saskatchewan, where he witnessed the unrelenting struggles of farmers and workers coping with the devastation of the Great Depression. Their pain touched him deeply and ignited in him a fierce passion for social reform and economic justice. His journey from the pulpit to the political stage was inspired by an unshakable belief in the power of collective action. Douglas devoted his life to uplifting others, driven by the conviction that only through solidarity and compassion could a more just and equitable society be achieved. He believed that by standing together, people could change the world for the better. Douglas entered politics in 1935, winning a seat in the House of Commons. He quickly gained recognition for his eloquence and advocacy for the working class. He joined the Cooperative Commonwealth Federation, a precursor to the new Democratic Party. This party shared his vision for a more equitable society. In 1944, Douglas led the CCF to a historic victory in Saskatchewan, becoming the premier. His government embarked on an ambitious agenda of social reform. They introduced groundbreaking policies like universal hospital insurance. This was a major step toward his ultimate goal of universal health care. His leadership in Saskatchewan served as a testing ground for progressive social policies. Douglas's most significant achievement was the implementation of universal health care in Canada. As Premier of Saskatchewan, he introduced the first universal hospital insurance program in North America in 1947. This program faced fierce opposition from doctors and insurance companies. However, Douglas remained steadfast in his belief that health care was a fundamental right. Despite the challenges, the program was a resounding success. It paved the way for the nationwide implementation of Medicare in 1966. Douglas, then leader of the federal NDP, played a pivotal role in this landmark achievement. His unwavering commitment to social justice had transformed the Canadian healthcare landscape. After leaving provincial politics 1979, Douglas continued to serve as a member of parliament and leader of the NDP. He remained a vocal advocate for social justice and environmentalism. In his later years, Douglas received numerous accolades for his contributions to Canada. He was appointed to the Order of Canada, the country's highest civilian honour. He was also named the greatest Canadian in a nationwide CBC contest in 2004. These recognitions reflected the profound impact he had on the lives of Canadians. Tommy Douglas's legacy extends far beyond his lifetime. He is remembered as a visionary leader, a tireless advocate for the underprivileged, and the father of Canadian Medicare. His unwavering belief in social justice and his commitment to public service continue to inspire generations of Canadians. His legacy serves as a reminder that bold leadership and a commitment to social justice can affect lasting change. The universal healthcare system he championed remains a source of national pride and a model for other nations. Tommy Douglas's story is an inspiration to all who believe in a more just and equitable world. Stay curious, stay informed, stay tuned to Irish Apers.